soon. Um, okay, so I'm Catherine Bragg. What? I will be singing Cruella de Vil. Um, what, my, fir my favorite Disney movie is Beauty and the Beast, just so you know. Um, it's, a, it's a good one, you should check it out. <laughs> about many of them, but uh, I think we can all agree here that the best, the definitive version of Cinderella is the one with Brandy and Whitney Houston. Yes! Yes! As long as we're on the same page about that. <laughs>
Um, so favorite Disney movie. This is gonna be a shocker, but honestly my favorite Disney movie is Big Hero 6. Okay. I did so much crap for that all the time. Thank you. That is hey, that's not. Uh, thank you. Uh, okay, now I gotta reach a far now. <laughs> Their slings and arrows flew, I would ponder, would you? Why me? Why me? For a man of my charisma and mystique, I have taken far too long to reach my peak. Why is my status always quo? Why does no one want to know? Poor me. Poor me. Why am I so unable to fulfill my true potential? Kept down by those I know are small and fry, inconsequential. What does it take to catch a break? Though it's agony to bide my time, I've got years and years and years before my prime. Plus, there's no one on the scene as resourceful or as mean. <laughs> Ask me! Who's the victor? Who alone? Who will overcome the throne? Who knows what to do and just how bad to be? Who's he? Why, me. <laughs> Cassia Di Roberto, Woo! soon to be Cassia Howard. Yay! I feel like when you're engaged, you just gotta say it, right? Um, all right. My favorite Disney movie is The Parent Trap because I love me some wow. Dennis Quaid, so I like the. <laughs> 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 all right, we're gonna take it down a lot of notches now. Just a 
man looking for my true vocation. My father said, now son, this choice deserves liberation. Though you could be a doctor, or perhaps a financier, my boy, why not consider a more challenging career? Hey ho ho, you'll cruise the foreign shores, and you'll keep your mind and body sound while working out of doors. Through friendship and adventure are what we can't live without. And when you're a professional pirate, that's what the job's about. I've said, lads, this is my only number. Now take Sir Francis, the Spanish all despise him. The British, he's a hero and they idolize him. It's how you look at buccaneers that makes them bad or good. And I see us as members of a noble brotherhood. Hey ho ho, we're honorable men. And before we lose our tempers, we will always come to ten. On occasion there may be someone you have to execute. But when you're a professional pirate, you don't have to wear a suit. Surgeon. I like taking things apart. I could have been a lawyer, but I just had too much heart. I could have been politics, because I've always been a big spender. And hey, I could have been a contender. Some <laughs> <laughs> say that pirates steal and should be feared and hated. I say we're victims of bad press, it's all exaggerated. We'd never stab you in the back, we'd never lie or cheat. We're just about the nicest guys you'd ever want to meet. It's one for all for one, and we'll share and share a life with you and love you like a son. We're gentlemen of fortune, and that's what we're proud to be. And when you're a professional pirate, you'll be honest, brave, and free. and I know you guys have all seen it, but, um, you know, it's, it's a movie that really sits near and dear to my heart, and it's, uh, The Lie, The Mighty Ducks 2. Uh, <laughs> yes. yes! I just really like The Mighty Ducks 2. Um, uh, so, so you guys, do you guys know the Notorious B.I.G.? Yeah. At all? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, all right, so, uh, no one knows this, but he actually wrote a song for a Disney movie uh, this is a lie that I'm telling to make jokes, uh, but here, this is the song. Are we, are we ready? Okay, well, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna rap, so that's gonna be great. I'm Tex Richmond, Mr. Texas T. Uh, people call me rich, cause I got more money. I got more cheddar than some supersized nachos. Got cash flow in my grab, I got the Nero's. I use more green than Vincent Van Gogh. I make the baker bake my bread out of dough. Oh, no, no, don't eat it, though. It'll make you ill, cause there ain't no flour in a hundred dollar bill. I'm Tex Richmond. Muppets were there, 
They were singing their show. They were telling their jokes and singing their songs. Why well, I couldn't laugh. I didn't know how. But then my friends, they all turned around. And they laughed at me. Oh, mama, they laughed at me. Give up your dreams. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine.
have a soul now, don't you? <laughs> Make your wildest dreams come true. I got voodoo, I got voodoo, I got things I even tried. And I got friends on the other side. The cards, the cards, the cards will tell. The past, the present, and the future as well. The cards, the cards, just take three. Take a little trip into your future with me. Now you young man are from across the sea. You come from two long lines of royalty. Your lifestyle's high, but your funds are low. I'll be to marry a little honey whose daddy got dough. <laughs> Mom and Dad cut you off, huh? So now you gotta get hitched, but you don't wanna get hitched, you wanna be free. But freedom takes green. It's the green, it's the green, it's the green you when I look into your future, it's the green that I see. Now you little man, I don't want to waste much time. You've been pushed around all your life. You've been pushed around by your mother and your sister and your brother. And if you was married, <laughs> well, you'd be pushed around by your wife. <laughs> but in your future, the you I see exactly the man you always wanted to be. Shake my hand. Come on, fellas. Won't you shake a poor sinner's hand? Yes. <laughs> Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Transformation Central. Transformation Central. Transformation Central. satisfied. But if you ain't, don't blame me. You can blame my friends on the other I think I would go with Aladdin because one, uh, can we all collectively pour some out for Robin Williams and for Howard oh, Ashman? Wow. Yes. Uh, boys. Uh, but it also it provided my first lesson in um, artistic expression and censorship because if you're old enough to remember when the movie came out in theaters, originally there was a line in Arabian Nights mm -hmm. where he sings, "Where they cut off your ear if they don't like your face." Which is an awesome line, and a lot of people got, with their people were offended, and so they they cut they changed the line to I think it's a where it's flat and immense and the heat is intense. Oh, oh you know, fine. But you know, I, when I was like six years old, I I, rem I remember my mom saying like, you know, the line about cutting people's ears off. That was a way better line, and she was right. Was learning experience. I'm talking a lot because my song is like 90 seconds long, but it's fine. <laughs> Here's a song about a tight one, and I figure every tight one needs a cigar to poke at people. <laughs> Gentlemen, we need to sell more papers. There's an answer right before your eyes, but you're just not thinking this through. Nuncio knows when he's cutting my hair. Trim a bit here.
taught lessons, for they'll see you through. When you're stuck in the muck, you'll be fine. You'll erase any trace of decline. With a sniff and a trim and a shine, and the power of the press, yes. in this song do not reflect ours. <laughs> <laughs>
Hey guys. Um, I'm Rob Mobley. Um, I'm one of your hosts tonight, or uh, your ghost host. <laughs> um, I, uh, I personally think one of my favorite Disney movies is Atlantis The Lost Empire. Pretty underrated. I like it. Um, but yeah, here's some Haunted Mansion for you. <laughs> Creek in the tombstones quake. Spooks come out for a swinging wake. Happy haunts materialize and begin to vocalize. Grim, grim ghosts come out to socialize. Now don't close your eyes and don't try to hide. Or a silly spook makes it by your side. Shrouded in a daft disguise, they pretend to terrorize. Grinning, grinning ghosts come out to socialize. When the moon climbs high o'er the dead oak tree, spooks arrive for a midnight spree. Creepy creeps with leery eyes start to shriek and harmonize. Grinning, grinning ghosts come out to socialize. When you hear the knell of a requiem bell, weird clothes gleam where the spirits dwell. Restless bones etherealize. Rise the spooks of every size. <laughs> To join our jamboree, there's a simple rule that's compulsory. Mortals pay a token fee. Rest in peace, the haunting spree. So hurry back, we would like your company. There's a little bit of a prep here, so hold on one second. Pretend you don't see any of this. <laughs> see what? We see it all. No! <laughs> okay, so, um... <laughs> so, uh, my name's Tony. <laughs> you see nothing here, shut up. Um, one of my favorite Disney movies, uh, it's, it's a tale as old as time. Uh, it's, a, it's a love story, it's got action, it's got excitement, it's one of the greatest stories ever told. Um, Emperor's a New Groove. Yeah. Uh, that movie has no right to be as good as it is. Um, I was like 20 when it came out, I think I, thought, I, think I saw it in theaters like three times. Um, it's just dope. Uh, but with that, we're going to try this one out, so let's, uh, let's get a little shiny. Well, Tamatoa hasn't always been this glam. I was a traveler to crap once. Now I know I can be happy as a clam, because I'm beautiful, baby. Did your granny say, listen to your heart, be who you are on the inside? To tear her argument apart, your granny lied. I'd rather be shining. Yeah. 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 Scrub to death can make it look shiny. I will sparkle like a wealthy woman's neck. In just a sec, don't you know? Fish are dumb, dumb, dumb. They chase anything that glitters. <laughs> Beginners. Oh, and here they come, come, come to the brightest thing that glitters. Mm, fish dinners. You look like seafood. <laughs> well, well, well. Little Maui's having trouble with his look. You little semi dummy mini god. Ouch! What a terrible performance. Get the hook. You get it? You don't swing it like you used to, man. Give you, give you credit for my start and your tattoos on the outside. 
For just like you, I made myself a work of art I'll never hide, cause I'm so shiny Watch me dazzle like a diamond in the rough Strut my stuff, my stuff is so shiny Send your armies, but they'll never be enough My shell's too tough, my open man You can try, 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 but you can't expect a demigod To beat a decapod and look it up You will die, 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 now it's time for me to take apart Your aching heart, far from the ones who abandon you Chasing the love of these humans who made you feel wanted You tried to be tough, but your armor's just not hard enough My way, now it's time to kick your hiney Say la vie mon ami, I'm so shiny Now I'll eat you so prepare your final plea Just for me You'll never be quite as shiny You wish you were nice and shiny Thank you. 
reach it. I know it sounds sordid, but you'll be rewarded when at last I am giving my dues. And in justice, deliciously square, be prepared. It's great that you'll soon be connected. King will be long time torn. Of course, quid pro quo will expect it. To take certain duties on board. The future is littered with prizes. And though I'm the main addressee, the point that I must emphasize is you won't get a sniff without me. So prepare for the coup of a century. Be prepared for the murkiest scam. Meticulous planning, tenacity spanning, decades of denial is simply why I'll be king, undisputed, respected, saluted, and seen for the wonder I am. Yes, my teeth and ambitions are there. Be prepared. Yes, my teeth. glitter in this number. <laughs> that, 
That's Santa's glitter. <laughs> Imagine he's in red. <laughs> So you're the one that everybody's always talking about. <laughs> you're joking. You're joking. I can't believe my eyes. You're joking me. You gotta be. This can't be the right guy. He's ancient. He's ugly. I don't know what is worse. I might just put a scene now if I don't die laughing first. Mr. Oogie Boogie says there's trouble close at hand. Cause then you better pay attention now. Cause I'm the boogie man. And if you are shaking, well, there's something very wrong. Cause this might be the last time you hear the boogie song. Whoa. 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 Nothing much to do. I just might make a special batch of snake and spider stew. And don't you know the one thing that'll make it all so nice? A roly poly Santa Claus to add a little spice. Your turn. Oh, 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 I'm the boogie boogie man. Release me fast or you will have to answer for the crime. The children are expecting me, so please come to your senses. You're joking. You're joking. I can't believe my ears. Will someone shut this fella up? I'm drowning in my tears. You're funny. I'm laughing. You really are too much. And now with your permission, I'm going to do my stuff. What are you going to do? I'm going to do the very best I can. <laughs> Too much fun, I must confess, when lives are on the line. Well, not mine, of course, but yours, your boy, oh, that'll be just fine. Release me fast or you will have to answer for this heinous act. Oh, brother, you're something. You put me in the spin. You aren't comprehending the position that you're in. It's hopeless. You're finished. You haven't got a prayer. Because I'm Mr. Oogie Boogie, and you ain't going nowhere. <laughs>
the swing is so the jungle VIP. I've reached the top and I had to stop, man, and that's what's bothering me. I wanna be a man, man, co, and stroll right into town. And be just like the other man, I'm tired of walking around. sing along to so like if you know the one word that appears in this song a lot then like feel free to jump in gosh it disturbs me to see you gaston looking so down and it does. every guy here'd like to be you gaston even when taking your loves there's no one in town as admired as you. You're everyone's favorite guy. Everyone's awed and inspired by you. And it's not very hard to see why. No one's slick like Eston. No one's quick like Eston. No one's next as incredibly thick as Gaston, but there's no one in town to act as manly, a perfect, a pure paragon, and you can ask any outlet or call it, hey guys, and they'll tell you whose team they'd prefer to be on. No. Thank <laughs> you. 
figured out what it is. Uh, <laughs> Enjoy. You know, keep clapping for them. They're coming up here. <laughs>